Good morning and welcome to Breakfast Television. BC patients seeking private treatment will have to make their opponent or appointments very soon. The province has passed legislation making it illegal to jump the queue and pay for private medical care. Also, Delta Police have released more information about an Indo-Canadian man who tried to abduct a young woman who had been standing by a bus stop. And a trust fund has been set up for the family of Jomar Lanot, the 17-year-old Charles Tupper student, was killed during a fight last Friday night. Police are still looking for his attackers. Let's head outside now for a first look at your traffic and weather with Karen. Hey, Mark, we're starting out at... Uh, uh, really good this morning, no stalls, no accidents.